Hello everyone, it's been a long time. I'm just giving a quick update today. I made a video seven years ago for my first stacking video and I can't believe the way that it's still lingering on today. People have commented just a couple of days ago and uh, I'm starting to do YouTube a bit more um, and I just wanted to put out another silver video just to give you a little update. If anybody who cares or is wondering, yes, I'm still stacking. Uh, I have bought Anytime silver was under $20, pretty much since 2013. The last I bought any was in 2019. I haven't bought any since. I tried to get some in the crash last uh, spring with COVID, uh, but there was just no physical anywhere, uh, so I haven't uh, bought any. But I have consistently bought and I've built a nice stack. I still have my safe, but I don't keep my silver at home anymore either. I keep it off-site at secure storage. But I, I really want to buy more and I miss having it around. I don't even really have any here except for one little bar, so don't have much to show you today, but I just thought I'd give you a quick update and also something that's, uh, of course, interesting, this silver squeeze that people are talking about with Reddit and all that and give you my take on it. Now, I'm a full-time day trader. I trade futures. I have been doing that for nearly 10 years. I was doing that when I made the first video. I wasn't full-time then. I, have, I am now. When I'm sitting down to trade, I'm watching it all day. It's right here. So I have it in front of me all day. So I believe I have a little bit of a feel for the market. First of all, uh, these guys, it's pretty wild what they've pulled off. But uh, on the, if you actually go on the Wall Street Bets forum, uh, they're, they're not encouraging you to buy silver. Some people are asking questions about it. They're not encouraging it, um, which is good, honestly, because I believe it would fail. You know, they've cornered the market on a small stock with a low market cap and a heavily short interest. Yeah, that's doable. Trying to corner the silver market, it hasn't been done in 40 years, and I don't think these guys are going to do it. I think it's darn near impossible to do it now. It's a whole different scale of a fight. Trillions of dollars compared to low billions. Uh, it's just not going to happen. But, I mean, we saw silver spike up after the open uh, last night, which was Sunday night. That's a lot of speculation, and from the physical selling out on the weekend, it's starting to fade back down now. It may well go up a little more, but I don't see it, uh, even if it goes up to $50. I don't think it's going to keep going from there. The kind of thousand percent gain like they got, and they got two thousand percent gain in GameStop. That's not going to happen in silver. It's just not realistic. But anyway, that's just my take on it. By all means, you can disagree with me. I could well be wrong. I have been wrong many times. I'm wrong just about every other day when it comes to a trade. So I think if they want to make more quick bucks, they better pick a fight that they can win. Anyway, as far as everybody on here, keep stacking and keep enjoying it keep putting wealth away i mean it's fun saving in silver isn't it isn't it you get to look at it feel it and hold it and it's just cool however i would caution on buying it um, anywhere up around 30 dollars. you probably can't even get any now there's not a whole lot of room for it to to go up and stay up in my mind anyway anyway thanks for watching have a great day and i'll try and talk with you again soon